This is how it all began 10 years ago on January 9th, 2004. Hi and welcome to Pop Export, a new program and a new face on DWTV. I'm Markus Schulze, but before I get bogged down in too much talk, let's start off with some music, some real export hits. For the past decade, Pop Export has been following the productions and careers of German musicians. 330 shows packed with concert reports, video clips, and band portraits. We love seeing which acts make it big outside of Germany. It started off as a bi-monthly, but Pop Export is now broadcast on a weekly basis. The show has won countless international TV awards. Fittingly, Pop Export started with a party. Live on stage was rock and roller Dick Brave, who at the time was riding high at the top of the charts. Guests included members of shock rockers Rammstein, like singer Till Lindemann and keyboard player Flacke. I was tired and didn't want to come. But I did, and I'm glad I did, because it's so nice here. Over the years, Markus Schulze has been joined by other Pop Export presenters. Hello and welcome to a new edition of Pop Export. Hello and a very warm welcome to another edition of Pop Export. Charts. Charts. These days, Nadine Vasta helps Markus Hello, present the English show. DW's German pop music magazine. Janine Reinhardt completes the team on the German side. Pop export. Ding, 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 dong, ding, a ling, a ling. Hello and welcome to show number 100. Today is show number 200. Always in a good mood. To mark the occasion, I have decided to clean up my act with this haircut. The show must go on. We've also sent our presenters out as roving reporters for Pop Export. Here's Marcus at a Totenhosen and Beatsteaks gig in Argentina. And of course, he checks to see that Argentinian record stores stock German punk rock. We want to know if you can buy Beatsteaks records here. Yeah? Which one? Smug Smash. Exactly. <laughs> cool. And here he is checking out the backstage area at a solo outing by Farin Urlaub, singer with the hugely successful fun punks Die Ärzte. Das you have got ja to be nicht. kidding me. What a surprise. <laughs> Farin Urlaub. In 2007, Pop Export got a new look. For the musical makeover, we got one of the biggest DJ producers in the world to help out. Paul Von Duke composed the theme music for Pop Export. There's so much music coming out of Germany, and that's exactly what's reflected in pop export. Also, the theme music represents the sound coming out of Germany that's known around the world. So I'm very happy to be a permanent part of that through the music I've made. Pop export is part of the scene. We've been involved in events like the Berlin Music Week and have friends and contacts in the world of pop. David Lemaitre is a singer-songwriter who got support from a German music initiative. Pop Export is a media partner to the program, which is sponsored by the government and industry. So we've presented him and other newcomers, like here on a boat tour of the capital city, Berlin. In 2012, Pop Export launched a Spanish version, Pop Extra. Hola a toda la gente linda de Latinoamérica que nos acompaña aquí en Pop Extra. Hola, gracias por estar ahí una semana más. Están viendo Pop Extra, el magazín con la mejor música alemana. And of course, Pop Export is present on social media networks. We've got tens of thousands of fans on Facebook, and our YouTube playlist is always up to date with the latest band profiles. You can now listen to the music we play on Spotify. We're ready for the next 10 years. And meanwhile, I say ciao, bye-bye, and hasta luego. Uh -huh.